My name is Mita, but sometimes I'm Mora. Mita plays with makeup and Mora is a hoarder. Hello. <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My voice is still a little raspy guys, so excuse that. I am fresh out of washing my hair. You guys have asked how I do my wash and go and get that bounce and those luscious curls. Well, here I am to show ya. I don't know, was that corny? I think that was just, just a little corny. <laughs> so yeah guys, I have my towel because I don't know about you guys, but when my hair comes out of getting washed, girl, this thing is wet, 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 but it dries really fast because I have low porosity hair, so my hair doesn't retain moisture. I have to steam my hair in the steamer with a deep conditioner for my hair to actually absorb all that goodness. So let's get right into this video, guys. Now, my go-to moisturizer, guys, and what really gives me that bounce and that voluptuousness is the Blueberry Bliss Repetitive Leave-In Conditioner. Conditioner. What? <laughs> what you say? What? What you say? By Curls. So this is what I use. I paid $11.99 for this. I will see if I can find it on a website, guys, and I will link it in the description for you. But this stuff is bomb.com if you have curls, guys. Yes, you need to check it out. <laughs> now, the thing is, I could leave my hair like this and it would just get poofy. But as you can tell, I have two textured hair, guys. So up here in the front, these curls are very springy. And back here, I have more of like a coarse textured hair just in this area here um this spot on both sides of my hair on both sides on both sides of my hair is the same kind of like a 4c here it's so weird and then the rest of my hair is 3c i have two textured hairs the weirdest strangest thing in the world but that is how my hair works so let's get right into this video guys so what i like to do is i like a middle part straight down the middle especially when I'm doing my wash and goes because it just evens everything out for me and then I like to put this in four equal parts so I flick this up I use my little clippers and guys I don't know for my curly girls if you know about these clippers but this shit is bomb for curly hair girl it holds that shit in place now like the other ones I used to have these other ones that were like more flat like look let me show you like, I had these before, but you see how they're just, like, straight? It used to, like, slide off my hair because it doesn't have, like, good teeth on it like these. You see? Look. These have, you see those teeth? And it really holds it in place. So, I love these. They're a tad bit expensive, but I wouldn't say so much. I think I paid, like, $4.99 for a pack of three or four. I, I don't remember, guys, but they're really good for curly hair. So we're going to start with the left side in the back portion of my hair. And I'm just looking into the mirror, guys, so I can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to take off this towel now, even though I'm still wet, girl. I'm still, my back is still wet. And we're just going to, I'm going to come up close so you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm using this brush and I'm combing lightly at the edges, guys, because, girl, my hair breaks for anything. And we are on a hair journey, so we are trying to retain length guys now let's just oh geez now what i do is each section that i go into i cut into two equal parts so i'm gonna pull this up and i'm gonna clip that up i don't like too big of a section because when you have a really big section in your hair and you put like it doesn't all get moisturized properly if that makes any sense like it doesn't my hair won't grab all the moisture like okay so now i'm putting blueberry bliss and i'm just gonna put this on my ends and i'm just gonna work this into my hair i'm gonna take my spray bottle that just has water i'm gonna saturate my hair make sure it's nice and wet then i'm gonna take my demon brush i'm gonna comb through that hair like that make sure it's nice and wet now i'm gonna squeeze out any extra like that and I'm just gonna comb again, rake and comb, and then voila, you got some beautiful curls in this thing. You see that? See the definition in those curls? So really, 
so really the trick is the um blueberry bliss and the diamond brush along with you know treating your hair with a deep conditioner making sure your hair is moisturized you know you got to take care of your hair if you want it to look pretty for you you know what i mean so i'm just gonna clip this get some blueberry bliss and i put a fair nice amount of product in there in my hand because like i said i have a lot of hair and my hair takes a while and it's really hard for my hair oh girl i just got mad water on my leg and it takes like it's hard for my hair to absorb products so i kind of rake it through then i'm gonna comb it with the diamond brush and it's nice and wet thank god oh sorry comb that again and then there we go you see this texture back here it is so weird it's so weird but what i do with that weird texture is i take it and i just curl it girl just curl that sucker so it doesn't you know mess up the dew so if you like me and you have to texture here just curl that sucker like that so that when it does dry it won't dry looking all crazy keep that shit at bay miss thing I don't be playing. Keep these girls tame, girl. See? And now you got those curls tamed and at bay. See that? And that's what I just do to my whole head. So we're just going to keep going. We're going to split this puppy in half. Bringing this up over here. And now we're just going to wet. Ooh, we're going to wet this guy. Sure, it's nice and wet. Nice and wet. Comb her through. Make sure you got a towel on your leg so that you know you don't get water everywhere. But yeah, make sure your hair is saturated with water. That's key to having awesome curls. Your hair has to be saturated when putting product in your hair. Like it really works. And I think they even do that in the Diva Curl Salon. That's one of their techniques as well. So it just goes to show you that it works. And then Denman brush and curls. Look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that. And then in the front here, I like to take one piece just to get those baby hairs laid. Hold on, sorry. And just kind of twist it like this. See? Just so that I have these baby hairs in the front at bay. You know what I mean? And voila. Got that shit laid and slain. Moving on up to the east side. Bitch, I don't know why I'm singing with my ratchet ass a voice that is like leaving me and shit. So I'm saturating that and I'm gonna comb through Get all that excess water out, Miss Thing. And what I like to do is I like to separate my crown portion, which is back here, from this front portion. And that's because my crown tends to be the driest for some strange reason. So I moisturize that by itself. If you can see how dry this shit is, look at this. Like, my crown is always so freaking dry, guys. Like, seriously. Like, even this part, I'm going to just take the whole thing, girl, and just moisturize that whole section like that. And then, you see how this doesn't curl properly? You see? Because the texture is different there. It's weird. So, I'm going to just twist it, girl. Twist it. Get that shit to obey and slay in this thing.
Hey guys, I'm back and so what I'm doing is I'm just going into these dry parts of my hair. I don't know dry or this textured or untextured or retextured or other textured and because it's such a different texture, it doesn't curl the way my 3C hair does. So I have to go in and manually do it as I told you guys before. And so I just do this around the crown area for some reason that just affects me there so we have two pieces here and I do it really fast guys I just wiggle my finger making it tight at the root and just coming down And then here is the finished product guys now what I like to do is I like to take a microfiber towel and just scrunch my hair like that to get all the excess product out along with it'll dry faster so yeah this helps get all the excess water out look at all that water and it helps it to dry quicker so you get a quicker drying time and it doesn't frizz the hair up microfiber towels are bomb so as you can see my hair is looking very nice those curls are popping and now when it dries it's gonna dry really really pretty so I'm gonna just bring you up close so you can see those curls really pretty 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 <laughs> and i'll see if later i will put in a clip of how my hair looks when it's all dry so i hope this helps to show you guys how i do my wash and go and i look forward to seeing you in my next video Mwah. love you guys bye Girl, I know you didn't see my video all the way to the end and forget to subscribe. Um, what are you still doing here? Go subscribe. <laughs> go, go.